Northwest Casting Service, Paul Masters, and he'll be leaving tomorrow, and he'll be one happy camper. And if you look close, we'll show you how to operate it. it See, it's a spring-loaded center. You operate with your foot. Yeah. And he's gonna be doing the, doing the mains. And the mains, you don't wanna take any more material off because that's your oil clearance there. So you just wanna polish it. Yeah. And you don't wanna take anything off. This doesn't even take off a couple of, won't even take off two tenths. We run at a faster speed when we're doing the doing the mains. Then next you'll set up and do the fuel fuel injector loads. You know, as you notice we already did them, but we'll run it back through the now he's gonna change it to the backup wheel. and we always run it one inch behind center. If you notice it even adjusts back and forth for, for taper. You know, all these things are flat, but on some of the old flat tappet forklift motors and that, some of them had a little taper, four tenths per half inch to rotate the followers. And you always come down after the peak. But as you and we also have a that's a two inch. We got an inch and a half backup wheel too. But the two will clear this one. Now it's gonna change over to an inch and an eighth, one inch. The other thing you like to do, you like to check the camshaft for straightness before you do this whole project. You can just miss handling or laying around as a cord, and they're very easy to straighten. I've done a lot of these for the locomotive people. It's another two feet longer. And they found that 90% of them just needed polishing. There you are. There's another cam done for you. Well, there you go. You know, give us a call. Been doing these things for 20 years. I'll guarantee you, you'll be happy. So don't forget to give us a call. And this will be on YouTube. And thank you, Paul, for the order and you can see how it's gonna work for you.